Hi, it's CryptoGuy in South Africa. So today I'm going to show you how multi-signature works and give it a step and show you how it works over here. So multi-signature is something that's been around for a while. It was introducing one of the upgrades we've done a while ago. Um, however, Tronscan only added it recently. So the multi-signature, you know, if you scroll down to a bottom of account, you can see it over here. So what I've done is I've got three different Tronscan accounts open brand new ones and then we're going to make this one share multi-signature with this one all right so i'm just going to copy that address because we'll need that then if i go here i can say my access i'm going to edit it i'm going to edit the access and what i'm going to do over here is i'm going to say for a transaction that happens under multi-signature with the active access it needs to have two accounts to approve it so i'm going to say Let's post this extra account. I'm going to say the weight is one. Okay, and then those two should add up or be more than above. I'm just going to make it like that, just to keep it simple. Okay, and then we're going to say save. Now, every time you make a change, it's going to burn 100 TRX when you make changes to the actual multi-signature settings. So I've said, okay, let's do that. And there we go, signed successfully. So now if I go back up, 100 TRX should be come off of that pretty soon. And then the multi-signature details should update accordingly. Okay, so the balance update to 400 TRX. We scroll down, we can see these settings over here. All right, so let's have a look at this. So what we're going to do is we're going to send 100 TRX to this account. Okay, so this is a third account. This is not the account that I've set it up with. I've set it up with these two on the left. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say multi-signature transfer. You can see over the access, I've got an owner and an active. Now both of them I can use. And if I do owner, you know, it's only one key that I really need, but I'm going to say active. I'm going to say to this address. And I'm going to say, let's send 150 TRX. Send, confirm. Okay, and there this transaction was successful. Now it's pending signature. Okay, so let's go to the account they set up with the multi sign signature. We go over here. I've just posited 100 TRX just to make the account active. If the account is 0 TRX, it won't uh, work or be active. Then we can see over there there's an unsigned transaction. If I go there, it will then show that unsigned transaction. Another way you can do it is just scroll down and say my signature and say, yeah, it shows all. Or you can just say show me the pending. And then we can sign the transaction. Okay. And then you can see how much time is left over. So let's sign it. And sign successfully. There we go. All and has been signed. So now that should be transferred to the other account. So let's go have a look at that. Okay, and there we go. There's the 150 TRX.